So this is the first example I've seen of a badger set being excluded by uh, HS2 under license from Natural England. So you've got netting all over here um, and one-way doors which will prevent the badgers. The badgers that can come out but they can't go back in. Um, what you think about this morally is, is, is up to you. So one or two degrees tonight, very cold, it'll be low, below freezing soon. You know, are these animals literally going to be left out in the cold? Um, this work can be done up until the 30th of November, which is when the badgers start to breed in the set so that when the females have young. So obviously anything happening after, they have to get this done by the 30th of November, which is why they've put it all in here. What do, you think, what, you think? what do you think of like how they've actually managed to do this without damaging the badgers initially? Because they've obviously, to get all this netting and infrastructure in here, they've had to cut the trees first, which means yeah. that they must have broken a law initially because you can't fell within three, you know, 10 metres of a badger set. Very good point. And also all the, um, the movement and stamping around and putting the netting down. I guess it's done by hand, but even so... Mm, the um, fact that these are screwed on to the base of a, of a, of a chopped tree yeah, shows yeah. that the, yeah, they've broken there's, the law. There's possibly some evidence around of badgers trying to get back into the sets. I'm not totally sure this could be rabbit, certainly rabbit droppings around it. I don't think that is. It looks like a, but, a paw print, um, doesn't it?